Hey George, I'm showing you how to do your kefir. So here's mine. You can see it's a little bit separated, the whey and the curds. And uh, it doesn't, if it doesn't get this far, it doesn't matter. Like mine doesn't usually get this far. I think I forgot a day. But uh, so I'm going to show you how I strain it. I take this top part off, take the filter off. Now you got basically sour milk. But it's all good. This is uh, a stainless steel strainer and a spoon. So I take this and I pour it all in here. It's a little bit like poop. <coughs> okay, so that now it's sitting here. Almost everything's still in here, so I kind of move around the spoon. You getting this thing? Yep. You don't have to get too close. And the idea is I'm pushing the kefir out into the cup. And all that's going to be left in, in the top side of the strainer is the kefir grains. Which is kind of like, a little bit like tapioca or something right there. So I take that, I drop it back into the cup. This guy goes in the sink. I take some milk. And then I put this filter back. The filter is mainly to keep like like fruit flies and stuff out of it. Let air in. Put this back on. And leave it at room temperature. And then same time tomorrow night I'll have more kefir. And then this thing I'll put in the fridge tonight. It's like six o'clock. We're gonna drink it tomorrow morning, so it's just gonna get cold in the fridge before we drink it. But I also drink it warm, no problem. Later. <laughs>